Hello guys, I hope you are all doing well. In this video, we are going to talk about some common format specifiers and constants in C programming language. So let's begin. The first question arises here is that what are format specifiers? Format specifier are basically the way in which our compilers know what kind of input it is taking and what kind of output it should show on the screen. For the input we will talk in the next video and for output we will talk in this video. Let's say I want to print that my age is 21. So basically I can write here something print as my age is 21 and in the output it will show me as my age is 21. Okay, But there is another way. Instead of writing 21, I will write here percent %d. Right? Percent %d. And this percent %d is a format specifier. Format specifier for the integer values. Integer means 1, 2, 3, minus 18, minus 220, 0 and so on. Okay? So, percent %d for integer. Right? And then I will write here comma and whatever value I want to give here, let us say I want to give here 21, right? then we will compile the program and run it, the output will still be my age is 21. right? So basically our compilers know that the percent %d format specifier is used here and the first value written here will replace this. Okay? We can also use multiple format specifier, let us say here I will write or percent %d and then closing of double quotes then here let us say 21 comma 22 and then at the end semicolon with parenthesis end. Now what will happen in first format specifier 21 will be written and in the second format specifier 22 will be written. So our output after compiling and running will be my age is 21 or 22 right. For the basic, we will only talk about the three format specifier that are generally used. The first one is the percent %d which will be used for integer values, okay, for integer values, right. And the other is percent %c for characters and then percent %f for floating values, float values, okay. Now float values means which has the decimal part for example 12.6 or 1.9 okay for characters like a b okay any symbol any letter any any digits if it is uh, written in the inside the single quotes okay for example this will also be treated as the character not integer because it is inside a single quote okay and integer values like 400 minus 12 okay note that in character there is only one character inside the single code there cannot be multiple characters right now let's say i want to print i want to use percent %c format specifier so what i will do i will instead of writing here percent %d i'll write here percent %c and then i'll write i close it and then i write a character now when whenever we are using percent %c we have to use the character in the single code so let's say i'll write here E. Okay, and close it. Now our output will be my age is E. Okay, note that no quotes are coming here, but here we have to write the quotes. Okay, and if we want to use percent %f, now percent %f will be used for floating values, right? So I'll write here percent %f, and here let's say I'll write here twenty one point five zero. Okay, so in our output, it will give us my age is 21, 21.50 and some other zeros also. Okay, Basically, it depends on the size of our variable. So, point here is that percent %d format specifier for integer values, percent %c, percent %f for characters and float values. Okay, Right now, maybe this is not looking so much important, but this is actually the heart of our C programming language that whether we are taking the input or output, we will be using always some format specifier, right? Now let's talk about the constants, right? Here 21.50 is a constant, okay? 
21.50 is a constant. 4 is a constant. Character A is a constant. Character B is a constant. 22 is a constant. Minus 22 is a constant. 16.2 is a constant. 14.3 is a constant. So what are constant? Constant are the values that can never change. Okay. For example, I cannot make 22 to 23. Okay. I cannot make 4 with the value of 5. 4 will always remain the 4 and 5 will be 5 in its own. So constant are the values in its own. Now basically constant are divided into the two categories which are primary constant and secondary constant and let's talk about it. So if we look at the division first of all we have C constants and these are divided into two categories which are primary constants, primary constant and secondary constants. Right. In primary constant, we have the integer constant, integer constant, right. Then character constant, and then we have the real constant. Basically, real constant are the float values. Okay, the values which have uh, some decimal points, right. And in secondary constants, we have array then pointers structures union enum and many more okay so basically secondary constant are made by the primary constant okay we will talk about the secondary constant in the later videos but for now let's focus on the primary constants only okay so integer constant would be like 44 32 then 16 right minus 12 okay 0 right so these are the integer constant right in co character constants there could be a b basically those which are inside a single quote okay then 1 okay 1 inside a single quote remember that and then let's say capital e okay like this and in real constant we have the decimal values for example 12.6 then minus 1.8 then 12.3 okay so these are the real constant here so constants are the value that can never change okay in the contrast of it we will see how the value of a variable will change as per our requirement okay so that's all for today guys i hope you like the video if you have any doubt please comment it down thanks for watching and i have to see you in the next video